Hey, today I wanted to do a quick review on this Ab Cruncher Cool and Abdominal Trainer Glider Machine that I bought off a Walmart website. Uh, the price was reasonable and um, the assembly took a very long time. It's um, basically due to the screws. The screws didn't match. Um, they wouldn't go in. Uh, you kind of have to put one long one with a short one for the part that's sitting on the floor where your uh, knee is going to be and uh, for the top part, uh, that part on the bottom where you're seeing. Uh, so uh, one thing I want to say is uh, when you're installing the machine, you might want to put all the screws and then see if you can screw them before you tighten all the screws because uh, removing uh, the screws after you've tightened them um, also is a headache. The machine also comes with five levels of resistance. Uh, so I was only able to use the middle level. Uh, you see here um, where it leans down. I could never get it um, to use the how you see it standing on the screen right now because, um, well, when you put the little uh, metal thing inside the holes for the different resistance levels the the thing wouldn't go through um, from one end to the other so it can um, um, be inserted properly and I have tried um, several times um, I even laid the machine on the floor and um, nothing really works so not all uh, um, those holes um, allow you to go from one end to another uh, that's I guess one of the default that the machine that I got um, comes with so I'm not sure if yours is also that way or if there's a trick of um, getting um, at least the first uh, hole um, the thing to go through the first hole uh, without any issues so I can use the machine standing up so if you have this ab machine and you are successful at getting that metal thing through the first hole or like the other uh, the first second or the last hole let me know um, but anyways um, I couldn't right now only use the the middle hole and um, it comes with this red thing that you put uh, right there in that space and honestly that thing doesn't stay when you're using the machine um, I, I just just remove it uh, You have to install the monitor um, The monitor so you can track how much exercise you're doing uh, That's very simple. Uh, basically. It was really the screwing um, The parts that took a long time um, that I didn't expect it was gonna take me and a lot of arm work and this machine is, is um, to help you with your uh, to help work your arms legs and waist I have to tell you after installing this machine I was so exhausted that I couldn't even use it that day um, so but after that you know one tips I can say is when you are using this machine especially if you can only use the middle hole for the resistance level you have to lean your body close to the machine um, so that your knees can go up if you don't do that it's gonna be so difficult you're not gonna be able to get the the knee part to go up so you can um, exercise so you, you'll see if you have this machine and if you have this machine let me know uh, if it has been working for you all right later